Welcome. So what I'd like to do is show you how to find a perpendicular line to the equation y equals negative 4 thirds x plus 5 that goes to the point uh, 0 comma 2. So to go through a kind of equation like this, again, I'd like to sometimes graph uh, what our equation is just so we can kind of get a visual idea of what we're trying to do when graphing a perpendicular line. So we have an equation uh, y equals negative 4 thirds x plus 5. So that means my y uh, intercept is going to be at 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then I'm going to have a slope of negative 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, over 3, 1, 2, 3. All right, so I'm going to have a graph that's going to look something like this. And we can tell that this is going to have a negative slope. So when we're looking at perpendicular lines, we know our perpendicular line has to then have a positive slope. But it also has to go through the point 0, comma 2. So therefore, I go up 2. All right, now I know this equation has to have a positive slope, and it also has to intersect the line at a 90 degree angle. The only thing I do not know in this case is what exactly is the slope. But remember, when we talked about perpendicular lines, when we went through the definition of perpendicular lines, we already know that perpendicular lines have to have opposite slopes as far as their sign. If one's negative, the other one has to be positive. And the other thing we learned about perpendicular lines is their slopes are reciprocals of one another. So to write the equation of this one is actually going to be pretty basic. I need to make sure I find the opposite of negative 4 thirds, which would be a positive 4 thirds. And then I need to take the reciprocal. So it'd be y equals a positive 3 fourths x. And then I, they do not have the same uh, y-intercept. This one has a y-intercept of 0, 2, which is actually given to us in the problem. So it'd be a 3 fourths x plus 2. And that is going to be your equation of your line that it goes through the point 0, 2 that is perpendicular to the equation y equals negative 4 thirds x plus 5. Thanks.